Hi everyone, in this video we're going to take an in-depth look at the Cox CGM 4981 Panoramic Wi-Fi Gateway User Manual. In your kit. Coax cable, power cord, Ethernet cable, Panoramic Wi-Fi Gateway, front and back view. After the gateway is successfully registered on the network, a single solid white LED on the top illuminates continuously to indicate that the gateway is online and fully operational. WPS is located on the back of the gateway above the telephone ports. This button can be used instead of entering the Wi-Fi password to connect wireless devices that support WPS to the gateway. WPS works only for wireless networks that use passwords encrypted with the WPA Personal or WPA2 security protocols. What you'll need, smartphone, tablet, or computer, Plug in the gateway, connect the coax cable 1 to the gateway and an active cable outlet. Then connect the power cord 2 to the gateway and an electrical outlet. Make sure the electrical outlet isn't connected to a dimmer. Tip, plug the coax cable into a centrally located cable outlet or use the same outlet where the old device was connected. Connect to the network. Wait about 10 minutes for the gateway to power on. Then open the Wi-Fi settings on your smartphone, tablet or computer. Connect to the network using the network name SSID and the password from the label on the bottom of the gateway. Once it's connected to the network, open a browser and surf the web to verify that your internet is good to go. Personalize Wi-Fi experience. We recommend you download the Cox Panoramic Wi-Fi app. It will help you personalize your network and optimize your Wi-Fi experience. Tips. <laughs> Customer support. <music> Troubleshooting. Warnings. subscribe to our channel.